Hey friends, welcome back to the channel, Creating with Sarah. Thanks so much for stopping by. So today's video, I have a, another huge Bath & Body Works haul. I did a online order. I picked up some things in store. Um, it was part of a couple of their sales. So if you'd like to check out this video, then keep on watching. Hey there welcome to the channel I'm Sarah all things creating planning yet keeping things fun and functional for you and today I have another self-care haul now it's a lot I know but I am trying to build up my fall or seasonal collection it's just something that I'm treating myself to and I'm absolutely loving it so I thought I would share what I picked up I also picked up some things for a neighbor just to show her my appreciation. So I picked up some things to put a gift for her for uh, like a boo gift and then also my husband. So I thought I would share that and maybe do an update on some of the men's collection. So let's just jump right in. I hope you guys um, enjoy this video. So let's jump into the online order. So everything came in this box. It shipped really fast. And actually I was really surprised. It came like a day early. And they were doing um, body care online only for one day. And everything was like $4.95, no $5.95 I think. All body care. So the creams, the lotions, and the mist. And um, it was also the same day they were doing the 10 off of 30 purchase. So I went in store and did a um, 10 off of 30 off of candles, and then I did an online um, purchase. So I got a lot of body care. And then also, um, as I'm filming this, the weekend of the body mist sale, they're doing uh, $4.95. So I actually got a better deal on some of the mists that I have here that were on my wish list online because I used the $10 off 30, so those came out to like $4.50 each than the ones in store for $4.95, but regardless, that's still a good deal. So let's just jump right in. Okay, I like that these came sealed. So I was kind of worried about buying body care products online and how they would ship because I didn't want anything like busting on me or whatever, but all of them came pre-sealed. I don't know if you guys can see that. So they came pre-sealed, so I love that. So I've been loving warm vanilla sugar i can't get enough of it it's it's an oldie but goodie and i mentioned in my last bath and body works video that it's kind of like a hit or miss in some of the items but i thought i would just try everything on me and see how it goes i love the body wash it's very creamy that's what i have right now and the mist like those are the two that i get most of the frag fragrance out of um so i decided to grab the body wash and then I have the lotion. I did buy the little mini kit. Um, I believe I had returned some items and had credit. So I used that credit to just buy the Warm Vanilla Sugar Trio travel kit. So I do have that. It came with a sanitizer, a lotion, and then the mist spray. So I do have that. So I'm kind of like stocked up on my favorite scent so far for the fall. I, I love this. I really do. Okay. Then I decided to pick up Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin because I really love the packaging on Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin because it gives me, you know, those pumpkin vibes and I'm trying to come up with some favorite scents or combos for October. Um, I'm going to try to do a video of what I loved mostly in September, but if you saw my video, you guys are going to guess it. It is the Champagne Apple and Honey. I love that scent. I love anything apple, especially in September. So it was just so good. So I'll try to do like a recap or something about what I really loved from all these hauls. But yeah, I decided to pick up the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. And I just really love the packaging in this one. I like that it shows more graphics of the pumpkin. Because I feel like this packaging... Um, let me just show you an example because I have the spray right here that I, I don't like when they all look the same, the packaging. It just kind of takes the fun out of it. So I like when they have some pictures that kind of correlate to the scent. So smelling this for the first time because I typically don't get this one, but I don't really have a lot of pumpkin items. And I was kind of shocked that they didn't have a lot of 
um, like pumpkin themed body care, except for like the pumpkin waffles. I just can't really do that one. Maybe in the mist because I'm not someone who likes like, um, I don't know, treats, smells, gourmet. It just depends really. But I think that one tastes too much like maple to me. And I just, I don't know if I can do it. Maybe in the mist to like layer it, but I thought maybe I would wait to see what's going to be at the semi, um, annual sale so maybe they'll have extras I don't really know but um, I just thought I would pick this up but it doesn't doesn't really give me pumpkin smells it's like a small hint of pumpkin but it's very it is sweet but I don't get cinnamon at all the fragrance notes are heirloom pumpkins autumn cinnamon ginger snap and whipped vanilla I don't know if I ever I don't know if I even get vanilla for me in my nose <laughs> I kind of smell just sweet pumpkin. Maybe the ginger snap, but I don't really get cinnamon. But it's a really nice, pleasant smell that I can um, use. I mean, it's nothing too strong and nothing too crazy like pumpkin carving that smells really good <laughs> in a candle. I don't know how much I would like that in a body lotion, but um, I'm glad I picked this up because I don't have anything that's pumpkin related, I guess I should say. Okay, then let's see what else did I pick up. Okay, I decided to pick up Together Weather and I only got the mist in the body lotion because um, this one, I wasn't sure if I really liked it, but I smelt it again in store and it smells really pretty. It gives me a perfume vibes, um, so it smells very pretty. It's something that I think I would wear in the fall and probably all year round actually. So, um, I know my daughters loved it as well, so if I really don't like it on my skin, then I will just pass it on to them. And then I just decided to pick up the lotion instead of having like a full set. I just thought these would be perfect together as a starter. And again, if I don't like it on my skin, then I'll just give it to my daughters. Okay, speaking of my daughters, um, my oldest loves Japanese um, cherry blossom. She's gotten this every year. She has it in the lotion and then the travel size she'll get it in the sanitizer she's had it in the body wash she doesn't have a full size though so i just decided since it was on sale to pick her up one i love that the top has like a red um spray that's really pretty so i got her that one you saw my first haul you heard me talk about the fresh vanilla blossom i decided to pick up the body wash because i really want to try it and give it another chance because i love the smell of it in the mist but the the body cream just gave me a different scent on my skin. I didn't really try this, and so I'm hoping that this will be better in the shower. Um, so I'm just going to give it a go. And if I don't like it, maybe I'll just have to use it up and get creative with it. I don't know, but I really wanted to try it in the body wash. I got Fall in Bloom. Everybody recommends this one and that it smelled really good, but... I mean, it smells good, but I don't know. It smells good, but I don't know if it's something that I really like for the fall. We'll see. Spraying it, it's not like, it doesn't really wow me, but maybe once I wear it and layer it with something, and I just thought it was a really pretty packaging for the fall, honestly, but I did notice how far this label is let me see if I can show you like I know this isn't in the same collection actually let me show you I have leaves I bought that one I did go ahead and buy this one in store but you see how the label is so, so far down I don't know why they did that I know this one looks like kind of like a gradient effect which is really cool but Yeah, there's just something about this one that doesn't really wow me. I don't know why. We'll see if I like this one. So I did pick up this one and it was on sale. So why not try it out? Okay, the last thing that I picked up online, I wanted to try Coco Paradise because I'm someone who loves coconut. I love the smell of sunscreen. Together probably smells really good. And I hear that this sort of smells like that. Y'all can see that I'm not a pro. Oh, it does. It does give me sunscreen smells. 
So the fragrance notes are salted coconut manoi, uh, sugared neroleum, I don't know, bronze sandalwood. So that's what I really love. I love sandalwood. So yeah, I'm glad I got this. It's kind of like a blind purchase because I watched a lot of people talk about how great this was and they, they're glad they snagged it up. And um, you can only get this online unless they bring it back for the SAA sale. Yeah, I just thought it, I would go ahead and just try to buy it online. And I love it. It smells so good. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. So I wish I would have got the whole collection, but I only got the mist and the body lotion. And again, this one comes pre-sealed, which I love. So I got this one. I love the smell of that. So out of this order, I got three mists, three lotions, two body washes, and a nice body cream, which typically I'd rather have the body creams and I kind of go through them a lot, but I have noticing people say they don't last very long. So we'll see. I feel like I go through the body creams more than the lotions. That was everything on my online order. Okay, so the deal that I did for in-store, um, $10 off of 30. Um, you could do it multiple times, but you had to get up to $30 to get the $10 off. And then you definitely, you know, have to be uh, a member. So it's super easy. You can download the app or you can sign up online. It's through um, your email. So in store, I just did the three candles to get to 30. So they were, the candles were on sale and then you could use the 10 off for 30. And you guys, I went and did it. I got autumn this is my second favorite fall that's leaves um candle and this is the only packaging they had this year um and i was saying that i wasn't really happy about it because i kind of like it to match my decor but it is what it is this smells so good it is a pretty packaging and it's something that i would burn like till the end of the year i would use it for fall i would use it for christmas and because it has this like coppery green uh, metallic packaging. So I will put the fragrance notes in the screen. This just smells so good. Oh my gosh, this one smells so good. One of my favorites. So I decided to get two. Love this candle. This candle would be a great like gifting candle. Um, I think it's very unisex. It smells so good. <laughs> okay, anyways, I got two of those. And then um, I decided just to pick this one up. I thought it was a pretty packaging and I haven't seen it before and it's called Harvest Pomegranate. And this is the lid. The lid is so pretty. I will put the fragrance note in the video, but I definitely get like berries and a little bit of apple. It says fresh picked apples, definitely plums. It says sweet black plums, but this is really nice and fruity. So if you like apples and fruit scents, you'll like this one. It gives me a harvest vibe with like fresh berries and apples. I don't know. I really like this one. So those were the three that I got for 10 off of 30. Then I did the sale where they did $5 for the single wick candles. And I wanted to pick those up in the Halloween collection. And two of them... Um, that were my favorite and then I picked one up for a friend and I like the fact so I did a pickup order they actually put the name on the candle so I knew that I was getting the ones that I ordered <laughs> so the first one I got was pumpkin carving this like seriously smells like pumpkins like roasting oh my gosh so you guys saw that I got the three wick and when I light that one up, you can sell it in my whole house. Like, it is like a 10 out of 10 candle. Like, this one is bomb. It smells, it smells so good. Um, so I had to pick this up at a different area or a different store because mine are completely out. And I got two. Yeah, here's my other one. I got two. And I love the little pumpkin. He kind of looks metallic-y. Metallic-y, it's not a word, but love this candle. So I will put the notes in the video. Just kind of saves time. And then I also picked up one, actually I picked one up for my husband. 
for a boo basket, which I'm going to show you guys because I also did the men's care. Actually, I think that was the same day, the sale that they did, the $5 single wick candles and then all men's care. They've been doing a lot of men's care, <laughs> men's care sale. Um, so I finally um, picked him up something to put in a little boo basket for him. But I picked up Vampire Blood because that was his favorite out of the collection when we went together. One night we had a date night and um, smelt some stuff, which is really fun. I've been loving that. I got him this one and a small one because he doesn't like the, the big three wicks in his office. So this one works for him or a wildflower. So I got him that one. And then for my neighbor, I got her the ghoul friend. How perfect is that? It's so pretty. Um, so it has a little skull on it. And I, again, I'll put the fragrance notes in the video. But I think it's okay for me to smell it. Yeah, and this one's very plum. Plum-like. So if you like plums and grapes, dark fruits, that's what this smells like. But it's very sweet and light. So I think this is a really great one to give to those who really like those types of scents. So I got her that. And then I also picked up... I think the wallflowers were still on sale as well. Um, not the best sale. I think these could go lower. Man, I remember when these used to be like $1.95 a long time ago. But I think the lowest now is like $2.95. But these were on sale for $3.95. And I got her the Harvest Pomegranate because I thought that one was really, really pretty. And I used one of my rewards to also snag this up for her. So um, I'm just going to do like a small like boo gift you know the boo baskets that are trendy right now um so i'm gonna give her this with um the ghoul friend candle and i'm gonna try to snag up a hand soap for her as well let me show you the um men's collection that i went with so this is for my husband it's so cute it's part of like my bucket list of things right now i'm planning a couple's bucket list for the fall and I thought I would do a little boo basket for him self-care of things and got him a little card got him some new like fun lather exfoliator and then just a new loofah then from Bath and Body Works all the men's stuff was like four dollars which is such a great deal um, because if you're not a member and they're running those sales, um, sometimes the cashiers will not get, you know, remember that. And so they have to scan that coupon to get the sale because otherwise these are going to ring as full price. And this is originally $14.95. So I got this for $4. And they actually don't carry this one online or maybe they do and it just ha doesn't have the color. I don't know. But we noticed that online... I think they don't have the apple one and I like the apple one but I wish they had more in this collection for the apple like they don't have a lotion or anything it's just the whiskey reserve and I really like the apple scent I'm being loud I'm filming this while everyone's here so. <laughs> um, yeah so I got him that um, I'll let you guys know if I can get an update from him if he liked this because he's kind of picky with his stuff so I have aftershave balm and this is a 3.4 ounce so it's, I think this is travel size. Yeah these smelt okay they're not really heavy they're really like light smelling and then I got the hair gel. Um, it says with bamboo extract and vitamin B5. Yeah they're a pleasant smell nothing too strong or heavy. Um, I think these are perfect, even for like stocking stuffers maybe. Definitely get it on a sale and I'm sure they're going to have another men's sale because they've been having a ton of those. So I got that and then I picked this up when I got the bucket at Walmart. <laughs> I got this Old Spice Gentle Man's Super Hydration Hand Cream. So I thought this would be nice in his office because he's always asking for lotion. And then got some honey chapstick so that's fun so with his little bucket which lights up <laughs> I thought this is really cute little theme and then with his candle so he's set to go okay last 
purchased and sale. And then I need to go on a no buy until Christmas stuff comes out. I think it's a little too early for Christmas because I know they're gonna have like a candle day sale. Um, so I can hopefully get Christmas candles then. But I'm not in a rush to get any like other things besides maybe soaps. So I have this last bag. Okay, since I did a lot of the mist online, there were still a couple of them that I just thought I would get since they were on sale for $4.95. And I really wanted the Halloween one. And the only scent I like is the one my husband likes. It's Vampire Blood. This is just a nice fruity smell, but it has jasmine with it. So it kind of gives like a date night perfume smell. So I really like this one. I would like to get like the body wash and maybe the lotion. Actually the body cream, because I really like the body cream. Okay, then I was going to use one of my rewards for this, but I'd, I'm so happy that they added the diamond mist, um, the shimmer mist in the sale. So, because this is originally $16.95. Mm -mm. So, I'm glad I picked it up for $4 because I really wanted this to like layer for date night and just I like the glitter effect, you know, and this is um, Sunrise Woods. I didn't, I'm sorry, I forgot to tell you <laughs> one of my favorite scents for the fall because it gives you like a perfume vibe. So I took a chance with the, the minis were also on sale. So these are originally $8.95 and um, they were included in the sale. So they were like four, which I think they should be originally that price, <laughs> but what are you gonna do? Um, so I got the Cozy Bourbon, and I mentioned in my last video that I'm not someone who likes bourbon smells, but every time I smelt this in store, I liked it. I start to love it. So we're gonna see how it goes on my skin, and I thought it would be great to layer, maybe do like a coffee scent or something um, with some of my body wash that I have, but I decided to pick up the smaller spray just to see how I like it. And then I did pick up leaves, which I shared earlier. And I mentioned in my last video that this would be a great scent like to spray in my car or to spray like in my closet where my laundry is or something, or maybe my bedroom. Um, but we'll see if I use this as a combo with lotions or body washes because I get a lot of cinnamon out of this. This definitely smells different than the candle. I mean, I get some of the notes from the candle, but I really get like a spice cinnamon from this mainly. Let me know if you have this and what you think about it and what, like, what do you smell when you smell it? I get strong, spicy cinnamon. So that's definitely gonna be like a house car spray or something like that. And then the other one I got was one, one of the newer ones that came out. And I decided to get this on the sale because it's not something that I would want. I just thought maybe I could mix it because I get a lot of almond in this, even though this has none of those. It's Harvest Sun, Fresh Wildflowers, and Bronze Woods. Maybe it's the bronze part but it definitely gives me more of a summer scent than a fall scent. But I, I don't know why when I smell this, I get a lot of almond, cocoa shea vibes smell. So I thought maybe I could mix this with something. Um, I have the Cinnamon Dulce uh, Tree Hut Scrub, so good. And I think maybe the spray would go well with that. You guys, I've been loving the self-care that I've been get, giving myself lately. It's been amazing. Um, so I look forward to shower routines now. It's just so relaxing. Um, and the smells are just so therapeutic and I just, I've been loving it. So hopefully I will sit down in my planner and show you guys like some of my combos and lists and things. Also with today's sale, um, as I'm filming this, it was, you know, the mist, fragrance mists were on sale. And then the candles were $14.95, not the best sale that they have, but I thought since it's also double the rewards points, I would just pick up a candle. I need to stop on the candles because I feel like I have enough. And again, I want to get Christmas candles, but a little bit later. Um, I decided to pick up leaves again, but in this packaging, I have the marble one 
So I have one already in this packaging and in the marble, and then I have two of the single wicks, but they were also in a different packaging if you saw that other video, but I love this one better. So I decided to pick another one up of this and I'll just use it up hopefully in November or I'll save it for next year and then maybe give the other one as a gift to someone. Um, but there was a lot. I smelled a lot of the holiday collection. There was a lot of like there was one that was a spice apple scent that I really liked. But I felt like I don't know. I just felt like it was too early to buy Christmas. I probably shouldn't have because maybe they're going to go out fast. I don't I don't really know. Um, but that was my entire haul from Bath & Body Works. Definitely give me a thumbs up if you enjoy this bonus content video or if you're new to my channel and you came across this because you love Bath & Body Works. I hope you'll stick around. I'm hoping to give like extra content um, of like reviews of some of these items and just some of my self-care routines and what I like. Let's chat in the comments down below. Let me know if you picked up anything for Bath and Body Works. What are your favorites? What are your favorite Christmas scents? So maybe I can start making a wish list. But that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you on the next one. Take care, stay safe, and happy planning. Bye!